The environment benefits from solar energy by generating electricity without using fossil fuels. Uh, yes, there's some fossil fuels used when uh, making solar energy panels, but uh, the benefit of solar energy uh, far outweighs the, the amount of fossil fuels it takes to make panels. Uh, so what happens is when solar energy is made locally and goes on to the local electric grid, uh, it is displacing electricity made by oil or natural gas or coal. So that's how it helps the environment. Because we all know fossil fuels generate carbon emissions that hurt our planet. Energy saves homeowners and business owners money because you're generating your own electricity right at your where your building is. So in New Hampshire, you can mostly assume that solar energy um, will save you about 15 cents a kilowatt hour. And for instance, an average solar array on a family's home will generate about six to 8,000 kilowatt hours a year. And then you'll receive um, those savings based on the rate that you get per kilowatt hour, depending on whether it's summer or winter. And that's through a program called net metering, where the solar back feeds your um, meter. So you're buying solar energy from your own array. First, as you can imagine, is a very important part of generating solar energy. You need to have sun if you want to turn the sun's power into electricity. So you want your solar array to have a really good solar window um, from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. in the afternoon. So you want to make sure that the solar panels don't have um, any shading during those times. And that way your solar panels will generate the electricity you hope they will. Well, some of the things that you need to know about solar energy is it's a lot less expensive to install uh, right now. Uh, it used to cost a lot more money to buy solar panels, um, but now they're much more available, uh, so they've come down in price. Uh, the federal government gives homeowners and business owners a 30% tax credit on the cost of installing solar panels. So this is a really good time to be installing because that tax credit soon is going to go away. So solar panels take DC power, or they, they take energy from the sun and make DC power, direct current. And then they'll send that direct current to an inverter, which will change it to AC power and then send it off to the grid. On cloudy days, uh, it still makes power, it just depends on the cloud cover, how thick it is. So I would say it's uh, an efficiency of 25 to 50 percent. Is of solar would be that you offset the cost of your electricity bill, you're buying local renewable energy, and uh, you know producing it yourself. Um, and disadvantages would be that great. There's also the cost of the install. It can be expensive. Um, usually it takes about, at today's market, about 10 years to pay back uh, to get your return on investment. So we're building uh, two timber frame pavilions on the, uh, the property for the Common Man restaurant. They have a ice cream place in Plymouth. And these pavilions will have solar panels on top of them when we're finished. So maintenance for solar arrays is really minimal. It's possibly uh, an annual inspection, but for the most part, the, uh, the inverter will record any information gained from the solar 